Vice President Yemi Osibajo's daughter, life in danger, as Kirikiri prisoner fixed the day he will kill her. Hey, my people, now don't hear this one. This one a very serious matter. We just enter our studio this very morning. No, this morning, this one now Yemi Osibajo daughter. Uh, I tell you, the vice president of Nigeria, uh, the daughter, her own very daughter, the one way then they call, uh, 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 I tell you, they, they say now this one now he be the very close one way, they very special to the heart of him, Papa. Now he, uh, they say the Kirikiri. Prisoner, they threaten, say, in go kill him, in go break out of prison, then come kill him. Waiting be the matter with this uh, uh, sweet little um, daughter of the vice president gets with this uh, Kirikiri prisoner of Shokuna. My people know this morning, as we they say, uh, make we the uh, say the, the ones where we will not get anything. They uh, they struggle to see how they could take escape danger. Even the ones we get something to, then see they exposed to danger. Now vice versa, it did happen everywhere. So I'm still well, very much wondering what will uh, a learned uh, say, person like Yemi Osibajo's daughter will be doing with uh, a Kirikiri prisoner. What has really transpired? What is the deal? What has she done with this person that this person uh, decided that he is going to kill her? Even to the extent of fixing a date for that. It is crazy. Let's check the content, my dear listeners. This is Morning News. The Department of State Services DSS has apprehended an inmate described as a slim young man. After a major operation at the Kirikiri prison in Apapa, Lagos, according to Daily Post, which exclusively reported how a large number of officers stormed the penitentiary last week in search of the fellow threatening one of the daughters of Vice President Yemi Osibajo. It was learned Monday night that the VP's second daughter, Kiki, an entrepreneur was the target of a serious threat to life. The extent is still unknown, with the Secret Service remaining silent. DSS agent arrived at the prison on Sunday, March 12th, and completed the mission after a 72-hour presence, which saw staff and visitors face additional scrutiny before entry or exit. It was gathered that a unit of operatives routinely moved round the premises in a communication command vehicle while the rest stayed outside. After the DSS left the top echelon of the Nigerian Correctional Service NCOS, in Abuja dispatched a special team to the prison on Thursday, the external officers were said to have thoroughly combed different cells for hours, confiscating SIM cards, undeclared cash, phones, and other prohibited items found. A shakeup is expected. What happened will most likely result in the transfer of some persons and personnel out of Kirikiri, a prison officer hinted. Oh, my people, it did happen. Uh, you see, our 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 Nigerian prison is no longer a prison. I'm very sorry to say, it. it's no longer a prison. If it's a prison, what will a, a prisoner be doing with things of this of this sort? I thought they they uh, collect everything that uh, belong to them before you know before uh, throwing them into the prison. So, what are they still doing with phone? What are they still doing with uh, uh, customized uh, um, SIM card or whatever? It, still, it means that they are still, even in that same prison, still 
communicating and still doing their criminal business. My people, we are not safe in this country. We are not safe. We are not safe at all. It, see, let me tell you, that's why it has been said that our Nigerian police are the most corrupt human being ever in this in in they are, the, they are the most corrupt force. You see that? So it's it's somehow and it's very much uh, we prove that definitely they may they may they may have uh, uh, they may they may have compromised with with uh, with the prisoners and they provided them uh, with all of those things and uh, so they, they they end up using it to do their business continuously as they used to do it before they were arrested it's crazy it's crazy so my people you have all heard this please what's your take what do you think what's your observation let's hear you and let's know what your take could be don't forget to leave them below the comment section Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.